A quality installation of a monitor pitless unit can be made easily and economically, creating a sound cost-saving solution. For the purposes of this video, we will be using a 36-inch diameter custom industrial pitless unit. Before beginning installation, establish the ground level at the well location. The pitless unit's upper casing should extend above ground level, according to state well code. Excavate around the existing well casing according to state and local codes to determine where the casing is to be cut. This is typically two to three feet below the berry depth. It is very important to understand the soil type and utilize a protective system. This video shows a trench box in place to prevent cave-ins. Find the well casing's plumb deviation and mark the spots using a level. Measure and chalk a line to mark the appropriate location to cut or torch the well casing. Be sure the well casing is supported when cutting the casing. Cut the well casing perpendicular to the well casing center line. Now remove the pitless unit cap, loosen the hold down hooks, and remove the spool assembly. Position well tabs on the existing well casing to help align and support the pitless unit. Position the pitless unit over the cutoff well casing and rotate the discharge body to align with the existing lateral water line. Next, tack weld the pitless unit to the well casing at the two plumb marks and tilt the pitless unit until its deviation from plumb equals the casing deviation. This procedure is necessary to ensure the spool properly seals inside the discharge body. By skipping this step, the drop pipe may bend creating additional stress on the spool assembly and preventing it from sealing properly. After the unit is completely secure to the well casing, pressure test the pitless unit to ensure no leaks are present. Connect the discharge outlet to the distribution line. The pitless unit is now ready for partial backfill. Be sure steps are taken to properly fill under the discharge line to minimize ground settling. Next, Install the conduit for the electrical wires. You are now ready to set the submersible pump. A waterproof splice is required on all motor leads. Be sure to refer to the installation instructions of the motor manufacturer for proper splicing techniques. You can now attach the submersible pump to the drop pipe. Be sure to rotate motor shaft to properly align with the coupling splines. Once aligned, evenly torque bolts in a crisscrossing pattern and secure in place. This installation incorporates a flow sleeve to increase the water velocity past the motor. The flow sleeve was required in this application due to the large 36-inch diameter well casing. Depending on your pump set, you may require multiple check valves. Check valves are recommended every 200 feet. Precautions should be taken to prevent damage to the electrical wires when passing check valves. A protective shield is recommended to prevent the wire insulation from scraping on the inside diameter of the well casing. Continue to couple lengths of pipe until you reach the proper depth of your well. The last section of pipe will connect directly to the bottom of the spool's drop pipe connection. Once the final drop connection is tight, Wipe down the rubber O-ring seals with a clean cloth and add a generous layer of petroleum jelly. The spool provides openings to allow electrical wires, probe tube, and air test line to pass through. Once complete, lower the spool assembly. An air test line and pressure transducer may be required. Both function as a method to measure the water level within your well. If a pressure transducer is required, a probe tube or conduit will allow for a simpler installation.
Once seated, tighten hold down hooks to prevent rotation. After completing the final electrical connections, you may install the cap. Congratulations on completing the installation of your Monitor Industrial Pitless Unit. For reliability, superior construction and overall maintenance-free use, trust in Baker Water Systems for all your water needs. For more information on this and other products, visit our website at www.bakerwatersystems.com.